Hey everybody, it's Hi hey everybody, it's Hydrogen Lily Pub. Last time we got to Fendrana Drift. This time it's gonna be probably a long part, considering we're gonna be going back to our ship, all the way back after exploring a little bit of Fendrana Drifts. Fendrana, Fendrana, whatever. And why the heck would um I be bumping my headset at this point in the game? Because it's not secure. I don't know. Oh crap! I did this in my practice file. I did this here. So, come on down here. Shoot that with a missile. Break it open. Go through here. And scan this thing. Turning on the door. Roll back out. La, 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 la. Oh yeah, there's also a missile here, but you can't get it yet. You need to have a weapon with extreme heat. Maybe it's the ice beam. No. No, just... No. Okay, new enemy here. This thing can really be irritating. It's called the Scatter Bomboo. But uh, the problem is, if you're not in Morph Ball, this is what it does. It messes up your visor so you can't even see when it gets close to you, see? Yep. So, we got another new enemy right here. It is called the mini... Uh, the baby Shigath. Uh, you gotta be careful with these guys. Because these are some of the most dangerous enemies. I always get scared whenever I see these guys in the room. I don't know why. They don't do much damage to you. But they can do a lot. And they can be irritating if you don't kill. So yeah, let's take about four or five hits. Um, they wake up when you get near them. You can only hit them in the back. That's only that's their only sensitive spot. And I'm making them look like a pushover, but believe me, they can get pretty dangerous. So continue over here, and we can climb up this ledge, jump over this bridge, and hop over to this platform, kill that guy, and come over here. Now, once you get through this door, you're gonna want to have your scanning visor out because. There's a new enemy called the Ice um, Ice Burrower. Uh, you, these things are limited. I don't know when they go away, but they do go away at a point in the game. So scan them now. There's also another enemy that you have to scan right now because it will be gone once you get your thermal visor. Um, we already scanned those, actually. Uh, if you don't want to get affected by them, you can just go into Morph Ball. So it's more Shigas in here. But what you really want to look for is right up there. Those are called Ice Shriek Bats. And they are only in this room in the entire game. And if you're playing the Trilogy version, they go away right after you um, get your Thermal Visor. So yeah, that can suck. If you're going for 100%. And I don't know how I did that so quickly. Come on. Okay. Uh, Chigas can be annoying since they use a breath thing, like they breathe a very cold air which can freeze you and you need to tap B rapidly to get free. Or they can shoot a ball of ice at you which does damage you and goes after afar. And I did not mean to go into Morph Ball and it's a projectile so it's pretty good. Pretty good. It sounds like I'm going to be using it or something. Now how do we get- oh yeah, duh. Over here. Um, door? Where's the door? Uh, it should be over here some- Oh, it's over here. Climb up onto this. And... Come over here. Oh, there it is. There's a missile door. Come through the missile door, and we have a... Another... Bombus thing. So, come down here. There's actually a Shigas right there, and if you can aim just right, you get a free shot in while it's sleeping. Yep, like that. Now, while you're up high, he's gonna try to shoot his projectile, but it doesn't angle that way, so it'll just go like that. Actually, it might angle that way. Um, we've hit it directly in the back. You know what? Screw him. 
Uh, come down behind these boxes, and there's another piece of lore here. Recording to logbook. Um, just kill this Shigus. And Shigus is dead. Scan this thing right here to lower the platforms. And there's actually an item that's probably one of the one of the greatest items in the game because you need to use it so much, which is kind of weird. Usually you have to use it a lot uh, once you complete it, but this actually can aid you in the second from final boss, which is awesome. Uh, you may notice the screen is shaking. That's because those things do disappear after a second, so be be quick. We got the morph ball. Now boost ball acquired. You hold your B button or your, I think it's um, jump. Uh, I think it's actually your. It might be B button in both games. Yeah, I think it is. So, actually, no, no, it's your A button in. No, it can't be. This is weird. Okay. Yeah, no, it is a B button in both games. That's cool. Um. Oh, so now we can go up uh, the cool little U-turn things, which is awesome, and come down through the door. And now when we hold B, we can just go really fast through these things, and you don't even have to worry about anything. This actually might be a really quick and short part. I'm not sure I'm going to go back through Magmore Caverns right now, I'm back to our ship. We can do that next time. So, yes, thank you all for watching. Remember, please subscribe. Sorry this is kind of a short part. This is kind of a jip, you guys. You should, like, um... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No! It's Ridley! If I were Sam, I would have just shot him right there. Like, boom, boom, boom. jump on down and we're gonna be going to save station sorry this is kind of a short part actually it's very short I don't know how long it's been but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be really short so thank you all for watching remember please subscribe it's been let's play Metroid Prime and goodbye so, whoa eight minutes yeah once I practice a little more it took me a lot longer to do that in my practice file so um, I, we're not ending this right here, so thank you all for watching, and don't goodbye. Okay, so, continuing on, we are going to be, um, I have not actually practiced this, so, better know where I'm going. Pretty sure I do, though. <clears throat> oh, that was disgusting. <coughs> oh, man. There's a point when a burp just becomes too pathetic. That was that point. I always wanted to put my morph ball in those holes. Wow, you suck. Wow, that guy sucks so much. Oh, you come on, guys. Give me a break. Ice spreader. So yeah, you have to come down here because we've got an elevator. And can we make it for the race? No, we can't. Actually, I don't. Crap. Seriously. You're really using health right now. 
Well, you know what? You suck. <clears throat> so your head fell off. This is the center from which all worlds can be entered. I'm gonna wait the time just to do this one. I can always hop, 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 hop. Okay. <laughs> I'll make. We're not hopping anymore. So climb up this elevator. Climb up this elevator. Ride this elevator up. <coughs> and at the very top. hit that door for a second. Okay, beetles are coming out of there. And they suck, so yeah. Hope I can do this tree thing on my first try again. <clears throat> like I did before. La, 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 la. Oh, so close. Oh, wait, we didn't fall all the way down to the ground. I always like to try to rush up this thing because it's so risky. Oh, you suck. Oh, oh, you suck. You suck so much. Game, you suck. I'm like, oh, I did it. No, oh, you suck. Okay, there we go. Third time's the charm. Flower! Oh yeah, duh. Kaboom! Disintegrated. Actually, do we take damage? No, we don't. I'm like, for a second, I thought we were gained damage, but no, that was the energy from the flower. <clears throat> so now that we're in here... Oh, man. Where am I standing on? Oh, that little branch. Cool. Um, we're gonna go over to this. You actually have to do this to progress in the game. Come on, Beetle. You want you suck. I'm just gonna leave you. If you get in my way, I'm gonna kill you. Okay, you're dead. So basically what you want to do is, when you get into the center, you just release your B button. And then you get progressively higher. Really? There. Oh. There we go. Okay. Now that we're up here, we actually have to get an item. Uh, you actually can't progress the game until you come over here, so. Kinda sucks. <clears throat> Little morph ball hole. Well, what the heck is the point of that? Just two stupid things in a row. Can we scan anything in here? Yes, we can. Oh. They're not gonna be mean like Metroid Prime 2 and make you scan the grass. Oh, for a second it looked like it was an ice door. Okay. So, there's your ship down there. What's over here? Uh, be careful that you don't fall because then you have to go all the way back up. What is that? What is it? Could it possibly be a power-up? <laughs> Super Feet Powers Activated! Okay, so, we can now have the space jump so we can jump infinitely. No. In this game, we can only jump twice, which kind of sucks, considering space jump usually means you can jump infinitely. They should just call it the double jump boots. <clears throat> but of course, they didn't. So now that we can jump twice, uh, there's a lot more stuff we can do. 
we can go back into Magmore Caverns and do all sorts of things with it. But, um, I think next time we're going to be going to Fendrana Drifts. Actually, let me see how long this has been. Because I don't want to, like, end it off being too short. So we had eight minutes, and now we add how much to it? Seven minutes. Yeah, we're going to end it right here. Um, thank you all for watching. Remember, please subscribe. And, 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 goodbye.